Y'all ready to eat with me? Okay, so if you can walk away, you can be saying your prayers too as you grab food, snacks, and drinks. Whatever you're going to do with me, just go get them and come on back. We don't have too much to talk about today, but anyway, go get it and come on back. I'm, got, I'm about to pray. Father God, thank you for this beautiful, blessed, and awesome day. Oh, Father God, thank you for ordering our steps in your name, Father. Use us like you do. Let this food be nourishment to our beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. So, hey, y'all, it's the weekend, baby. It's not like I got something to do. I've, I've been off work from August. <laughs> so here, it's still the weekend. Let's cheer for a good weekend. We got a little cool weather coming, a lot of rain, and I'm okay with it. Cheers, y'all. Oh, this vodka and cranberry. You know, when you use different cranberry juices, some of them just so sweet. This one is kind of sweet. So, y'all, we got some thin cut ribeyes. Oh, it's so tender, y'all. We did uh, them on the grill in the Ninja. They are looking juicy. Y'all see all that? Can y'all see the juice? I know it's going to look, look at all that good juice, y'all. It has been resting. We have some, uh, mm. oh, damn, that seasoning good. You know, that's my seasoning. I'm about to put on the market, y'all. It's really good. We have three cheese, biotoni, ravioli, and then I made some garlic butter. Just with garlic, uh, minced garlic, butter, garlic powder, uh, basil, and uh, Italian seasoning in that butter. On the side, y'all, we do have our water. We have that Louisiana sauce that I don't think I'm going to do. And then we have some steak sauce that I'm just going to dab. Uh, I don't want it all over my steak. And then I might just dab my steak in the uh, butter sauce. How about that? How was your week? Did you work hard? What's the plans for the weekend? I have plans on tomorrow. If the rain lets up, we're going to a Greek festival. We're going to have us some fun. And I'm so ready. Then we're going to go to, uh, um, not a flea market, but um, mm, a produce uh festival for, you know, uh, vegetables and fruits and nuts and jams and all that goodness. So, yeah, we're going to do that as well. So, I'm ready to do it, y'all. We're going to eat a little and then we'll chat a little uh, here. Oh, let me, well, let me dip it for you, child. Ooh, look at that. Do y'all see that? Ooh, I am so ready for this, y'all. It is hot. Mm. Oh, goodness gracious. Mm. Child. Mm. That really is good. Oh, y'all, we didn't do a timer. Let's do it. Mm. That's good. And I want to take a picture from my, on my food, y'all. Can I do that, too? Let's see. Perfect. So that's it. That's all, y'all. Oh, that ravioli is really good. That's the first time I bought this one. Mmm. That's good. That the timer. How long are we gonna talk, y'all? Not long. <laughs> I always say we ain't gonna have no long video in this long. Mmm. Let's see. That is that butter sauce is bombing. It's really good. All right. Let's do it again. Because that was that's good. I didn't want no marinara sauce. If y'all could see all that, let me let me show y'all. When, when when you bring it up, you see all them seasonings in there on there? Y'all, this butter sauce is bombing. Mm-mm. It's dripping.
Mm, that is so good, y'all. I don't have a fork. Well, let's see what it looked like. Oh, that was easy to cut. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that go my pink. <laughs> that my pink, pink. Y'all know I like mine medium well. It's y'all. It's cutting like butter. I don't know why this moving. There you go, y'all. Let's see what it tastes like with the butter. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, look at all that garlic. Oh, it's so freaking tender. And I seasoned it for a couple hours, y'all. Mm, look at all that. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Damn. Mm. That's so good. And I ain't know what I was gonna cook today, right? Cause mm, my um seafood, my blue crabs, and my shrimp, I'm making gumbo on Sunday. So I needed my um uh, I needed my seafood. And I'm feeding a couple of people. So I needed it all. This is so good. Mmm. It's just so tender. I only grilled it in the Ninja for two minutes on one side and three minutes on the other. That was it, y'all. I did put some vegetable oil over it as well. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, y'all see it just fell apart. Mm. Mm. It's good. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Man, I put my foot in this, y'all. Y'all looked up. I don't have my bright lights on. Can y'all see me good? Mm. Mm. The only thing I need on the side of this is uh, some seasoned to uh, tomatoes. This is good. And it got a little crisp on the end, y'all. That's bomb. And they big too, y'all. I showed y'all, right? And the other one down here is big too. <laughs> oh, y'all can't even get that. <laughs> I'm glad I chose the uh, ravioli. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. It's seasoned out good. Yeah, that's just bomb. Are y'all tired of me saying that? But it's good. Mm. Mm. Maybe one time I may try to um, fry ravioli. Have y'all fried ravioli? I haven't. It's always with marinara. So I'm glad I did the butter sauce. The garlic butter, that is. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. 
Damn, it's good. I don't even need the steak sauce, y'all. I don't want no hot sauce either, y'all. Somebody is stuffing somebody in a car? Y'all ready for Thanksgiving? Two more weeks, y'all. We will be burning and cooking. Those smells with cinnamon, nutmeg, cornbread stuffing, mm -hmm, green beans, sweet potatoes, mac and cheese. Did y'all see that? Oh, y'all, that's beautiful on the inside. Just gorgeous on the inside. Y'all, do y'all like... Well, that just cuts like butter. Do y'all like the fat on your on your ribs? I like some of it. I don't like it all, though. Oh. I didn't even have to cut that one. Y'all, I'm having a hot flash, and it's hot. I'm truly having a hot flash. Do y'all see me shining? Am I shining? Look at all that butter. I mean, that, that garlic, y'all. That is so good. Mm. Mm. Now, what's the word I hear these uh, people saying? Bussing? What the hell they mean? It's bussing. What that mean, y'all? Y'all got to teach me this new slang because I don't know. I'm not in the world. I'm trying not to moan so loud because y'all would think I'm having sex because this shit is good. It is. Okay, let's talk. Your yeah, arm's sweating. Mm. Now, this is going to be about our children. Grown children. Really grown. Now, y'all know I've been laid off. But I still have money. I ain't going to tell y'all how much. Um... One of my sons called me and because he left his girl and he is in a uh, extended stay. Um, of course, he moved, uh, I'm going to say, out of his pay period. So he asked me, well, he told me what he was going through. And I said, well, I'm going to use some of my money and I'm going to pay it for seven days. 
and I did as a mother. But I also told him, y'all, you're going to pay me back for this amount of money. You're going to pay me back in two installments, half and half. But if you don't give me back my money, because you told me the day before, the last moment, so I had to figure out what I was going to do. Is it wrong for me to ask him to pay me back? Comment below, because I did ask him that. And I also told him, if you don't pay me back, don't ask me for no more money. So, we'll see. So, would y'all ask your children? I mean, if it was, you know, 40 50 60 70 dollars, I wouldn't ask it back, but it was a, quite a bit of money for seven days. No, and... Those of y'all who know me know I'm going to retire early at 62. And I don't want to dab into my savings. I don't want to dab into my 401. Because that's my um, retirement money, right? And then I want to purchase a van. Uh, a built-out van or a small RV because I want to uh, travel the world as far as I can on four wheels because I'm not flying. So, but however, y'all know we make plans and our plans not always intact. So, because we don't know what's going to happen. And let me ask this question. Do y'all agree to help your children who is working because they're helping themselves versus one that's not doing anything and too lazy? My thought is if they're trying to help themselves, I'll help you. But if you land on your butt doing nothing, don't ask for my help. And with that, I don't care who you are. At all. We're talking about dating um, in a couple of days. I have a new suitor. <laughs> Can I say that? <laughs> I don't know what we're going to do. We're just talking. I'm not going to get excited like I was. I ain't going to do that no more. We just got to see what it do. It's going to do what it do. Period. Oh yeah, I'm getting full. That's that. that, that that's them. Uh, uh, pot that pasta. Y'all gonna uh, cook gumbo with me on Sunday if God say the same. Mm. I don't know if I could eat this whole steak, y'all. But it's oh, that's just so buttery. Hmm. <laughs> We running out of time, y'all. One day I'm gonna try to do a mook bomb with no talking. <laughs> I'ma try. Let's cancel. Hmm. That was so good. I may eat a little bit more, not much more, 
Blessing, beautiful hoodsters. Oh, thank you for all my new hoodsters that subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell, though, because you know you want to see everything this hood girl do. Mm-hmm. So, let's sing. It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance to run on the other side. So, whatever you do this weekend, do it good. Do it with purpose and do it with divine favor and love. Peace out, hood.